So we went for a new recipe tonight. This is a uh, chop suey, chicken chop suey with sprouted beans. Mm. Pretty good. And we're also going to try this new sparkling water. Is that what mm. it's called in English? Sparkling water? Yeah. Yeah, it is. What is it? It's lime and watermelon. Cheers. Cheers. Mm -hmm. Let's try it. Oh, yeah. I like it. Do you? Mm. <laughs> you don't seem so sure. It's pretty good. Yeah, it's not bad. I like watermelon. Alright, we have a freshly groomed husband. Yep. <laughs> with his summer haircut a little earlier this year. <laughs> I like that one. I like that better than completely. Yeah, than a full buzzed. buzzed. Yeah. Just have to maintain it more often, but that's okay. Yeah. Look, guys, I'm so proud of my husband. He made the bed this morning. Would you be able to tell that he's blind? He makes beds perfectly. Thank you, Bebe. Uh, you're unblinding the neighbors. Thank you as well. <laughs> <laughs> guys. Hey. Guess what? We just realized that we haven't showered in over two weeks. Uh-oh. Uh <laughs> <laughs> That's because we don't have a shower. That is correct. But we do have a bath, so we've been yes. bathing. <laughs> yeah, you don't have to worry. <laughs> yeah, don't worry. No. If my hair looks dirty, it's because it is. I wash it every day, but... It's so thin that... It gets greasy almost instantly, but um, I have been bathing, and so has this guy, and yeah. we're not too smelly, right? No. <laughs> no. So yeah. So yes, we are we are bathing. So don't so don't so don't worry. You know, like, you don't have not... to stay away from us. No. <laughs> uh, I think it does the job just as good as a shower. <laughs> yeah. Oh yeah. Yeah. Like we're not drenched in sweat. <laughs> no. Ew. No. <laughs> Good morning guys. Yeah, I'm here somewhere. I'm on the bike in the dark, but the sun is rising outside. So beautiful. I didn't realize. Yes, we're on the east side. So our other apartment, we used to see the sun sets because we were on the west side. It was beautiful. Like we would see the sun set behind the mountains. But here we see kind of like the sun rising behind the trees. Look at this. Oh, there's a screen you can't really see, but it's kind of dirty. I'll show you a better view when the windows are cleaner. <laughs> All right. Welcome Alrighty. to Rapid Fire Questions. All right. <laughs> with Randy as the interviewee and Miriam as the interviewer. Yeah. All right. Okay. When you're not working, how do you like to spend your time? Well, I like to work out. I like to build my build my muscle. What are you reading currently? Currently I am reading a book called Deep Men Mentoring. What's the first concert you attended? Have you skipped that? Yeah, I don't remember the first concert I attended. <laughs> What's a concert you attended? Uh was a Starfield concert, but now that band doesn't exist anymore. Oh. <laughs> What's your favorite book? Oh wow, my favorite book. Well, obviously the uh, the the Bible. And which book of the Bible is your favorite? Psalms. What's your favorite word? Hmm. Favorite word would be courageous. What was your first job? 
my first job depends how far back we're going here first when i was a kid <laughs> i guess i would say was helping to deliver um uh news newspaper pa papers or like uh right you know these christmas uh calendars not calendars but these big book like sears christmas book that kind of thing oh Okay. I believe that's what it I was, if I, if I remember correctly. <laughs> it's a little while. It's a little while ago. Was either that or news or newspaper pa papers? What is your most used emoji? My most used emoji would probably be a purple heart. <laughs> I wonder why. <laughs> <laughs> purple being my favorite color, huh? Yeah. Hmm. How fitting. <laughs> if you could change your name, what would it be? Oh man. Um, hmm. I would say probably a first name, maybe would be like, yeah, um, Alexander maybe, or like, uh, James. Now here's my question for you. Uh-huh. When you actually change your name for real. Yeah. Why did you choose Randy instead of those two names that you mentioned? I don't know. I don't know. I, I guess Randy already was a part of my name. Was my middle name? Oh, okay. That's why you that just point. kept that. So I just and then kept you it. changed your middle name for another one, then. And I yeah, changed my middle name to okay. Richard. Yeah. Cool. Uh, what was your favorite subject in school? Favorite subject in school, probably a tie between Bible and phys ed. What's your hidden talent? Hidden talent. Um, hmm. Oh, boy. Ah. That's a hard one too. <laughs> Not so it. hidden, but you can play the guitar very well. Yeah. And djembe. And the djembe. Oh my. You I, can play the djembe. I definitely love playing the djembe, yeah. I think that's what you should answer. Probably, probably <laughs> the djembe, yeah. If you had to eat one thing for every meal going forward, ugh, what would you eat? <laughs> oh man. Um, I would say probably a Thai stir fry. With, you know, some nice Thai sauce and. The one that I make? Well, the one that you make is really good. You know, but... just, just add cayenne <laughs> pe pepper and make it really spicy. You'd have a sore stomach. <laughs> Eating just that, you have reflux every day. <laughs> <laughs> and, of course, a steak. Oh. Yeah, you, can't, you can't go wrong with a steak. Yeah, well, <laughs> according to you. <laughs> Okay, one more question. But before you say the be, be, sorry, before you say the next question. Yeah. Um. Yes, you do a very good job of uh, cooking, though. I am. I am. I am very happy because I know I'm eating healthy as well too. So that's important. Thanks. Yeah. What's one thing about you that surprises people? Um, that I don't let my visual disability define who I am. Mm-hmm. I agree. Yep, yep, yep. Any final words? Any final words? Peace. Well, peace is, <laughs> peace is important, yes. <laughs> Especially in today's day and age um, with this pandemic. Uh, be strong and courageous in God's strength. Yes. Thank you for answering my questions. Yeah. <laughs> oh, guys. I gave up and I put a bobby pin in my hair. Because it was getting so long and like falling into my eyes and I was always doing this. So I would just put a bobby pin until like in three weeks when I actually have my hairdresser appointment. <laughs> it's coming. Three more yep. weeks. Three <laughs> more weeks. All right. So guys, we'll see you next week. And until then. Remember to laugh hard. And to love much. Week. <laughs>